welcome all of you to this video. In the previous video, we learned how to construct similar triangle using by scale factor method. Today, in this video, we will learn to draw a tangent to a circle from a point outside the circle. Can you tell what will be the number of tangent lines drawn from the point to the circle in each case? To try yourself, pause the video and then match your answer. Here in this case, the point is inside the circle. And as we have seen in the previous lesson, that from the point inside the circle, the tangent line cannot be drawn on the circle. So, the number of tangents here will be zero. The point here is on the circle. And we know that from any point on the circle, there is only one tangent that can be drawn on the circle. And only two tangent lines can be drawn from the point outside the circle. Let us now see how tangents can be drawn on a circle from a point outside the circle. A circle whose center is O. Let the point outside be T. Tangents are to be drawn on the circle. To do this, first we join the points O and T. That gives us the line segment OT. So now, let us bisect the drawn line segment that is OT. from which we get the midpoint M of the line segment OT, which divides the line segment OT into two equal parts OM and MT. The point M is the center and taking OM and MT as radius, let's draw a circle, which intersects the given circle at point P and Q. Now join the point T to the point P and Q. Now we will find out using the properties of tangents whether the two lines PT and QT are tangents to the circle. Let's see how. Matching point O with point P which gives us the line segment OP, which is the radius of the circle. So now you can see that the angle TPO is an angle formed in a semicircle. And we know that the angle formed in a semicircle is a right angle. Hence, the angle TPO will be a right angle. So now, can we say that TP is perpendicular to OP? Absolutely correct. These two are perpendicular to each other. And as we learned in the previous lesson, the tangent line is perpendicular to the radius of the circle. So we can say that TP will be the tangent line of the circle. So can we also say that TQ is also the tangent line of a circle. Using what we learned today, you can find the answer to this question yourself. Today in this video, we learned to draw a tangent to a circle from a point outside the circle. In the next video, we will see some examples based on this.